Well, our whole aim is to try and make the houses greener, so more energy efficient and more affordable for our customers. So we look at a variety of measures. We're looking at solar panels, at heating, at insulation. Each house is looked at on a kind of one-to-one -one basis, really. It's a huge challenge for us retrofitting all of our properties. We've got 38,000 properties. We're looking at the 9,000 that are the poorest performing at the moment, but we have to assess each one individually. But it's a massive challenge, not just logistically, but also financially. So we try and draw down as much funding as possible from government and from other sources, because ultimately it's our customers' money that we're trying to save. And um, looking at sustainability generally, is it just heating that you're looking at? And are there other issues connected with sustainability that you're looking at in terms of housing as a whole? Now we're trying to look at the sustainability of the whole community, really. So it's not just individual properties. We have to look at the individual properties from a retrofit point of view. But alongside that, we're looking at things like how the community can be more sustainable. How do we make sure there's training and employment in communities? How do we make sure people have the skills, are able to access work? The other element of that is probably thinking about customers' behaviour, because the house is only a part of it, and it's how our customers use our house that's really, really important. The Givor Tin Mine Geothermal Project, how does that sort of fit into your whole sustainability outlook for the area? At Giva Tin Mine, we're working with Cornwall Council, the National Trust and the mine to look at the feasibility of running air source and ground source heating using the existing mine shaft. So that will provide heating for an estate that's adjacent to the mine, as well as the two visitor attractions. And we see that as a way of us testing out new technologies, testing out new approaches, to try to make sure that we're doing the best for our customers now, but also planning for the future as well.